631 now new this morning. If you have a kid that you're getting ready to take to daycare here soon, you likely know the challenge that it can be to find care. New this morning, Illinois Governor JB Pritzker has announced $1.6 billion in federal money to help struggling daycares and in turn, hopefully help families. Yeah, as a parent, I have grandpa as daycare and I'm pretty lucky because I know a lot of families out there that are still on the wait list and it can take months, even years to get on it. WGM's Isabella Rossi is live in Quincy this morning to explain how one local daycare plans to hopefully use some of that money. Isabella, good morning. Natalie, local daycares say the biggest problem they're facing right now are staffing shortages. Here at 10th Street Children's Academy, they say you could fill out one of their applications, get approved, and still have to wait months before your child could get a spot here. Allison Bearhorst, a director at the daycare, says they're having trouble finding enough employees to help more families. She says daycares have struggled to compete with schools on wages, saying their wage is lower than any school in the district. So with this new money from the state, she plans to use it immediately on the staff because there's a lot of uncertainty. So because of those fundings, it's not, um, we don't know of the longevity, longevity of that. So um, something that we're doing is as long as that we have the capability we're providing bonuses for our staff and incentives and um, especially those ones who are working long hours in the staffing shortage bear horse says the child care industry often has burnout and quick turnover and this funding could provide a big morale boost for the staff Bear Horse says that if a family applied to the daycare this morning, they likely wouldn't have an open spot until November or December, and she expects that wait to get even longer as more parents return to work after the pandemic. Live in Quincy, I'm Isabella Rossi, WGEM News. Isabella, thank you. And here's some more information on the projected timeline for this funding. West Central Child Care Connection says that they don't know when or how much money will be coming to local facilities because that was just announced last week. But the executive director, Marla Willard, says portions of the money must be spent by the end of June. So she expects to have a better timeline next month.